Hi ladies and gentlemen, I want to show you how to resolve the issue of ACK getting an error message saying that the Microsoft SQL Server is not running. That will prohibit ACK from running. Now, don't try to figure out why this is happening. The easiest thing to do is just fix it. So let me show you how you do that. On my keyboard, there's a Windows logo on one of the keys on the left hand side on the bottom. I'm using a regular keyboard. I'm going to press that down as I press the letter R as in Romeo. This box pops up. In this box, you're going to type in services.msc. Let me take the highlighting off so you can read that a little easier. Services.msc, Mary Sandy Charles. Click OK. And a box is going to pop up showing some of the services that are running on your computer. You're going to scroll all the way down till you get to the one that says SQL Server in parentheses Act 7. A quick way to jump down there is if you click on any one of them and press the letter S, it jumps down to all the items that begin with the letter S. So here's the SQL Server right there. Now there's a couple things you should observe. Up here on the left hand side it says Stop, Pause, and Restart. If you double click on it, and this opens up, what you should see is that it says startup type automatic. That's the setting you want, so it automatically starts up. Sometimes this doesn't happen. If that's the case, you can click on start to get it going, or if you want to get away from this, you could click cancel, and you could have just clicked on restart over here. So that's all you do, and once you do that, try open up your ACT database again, and you should be all set. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. Have a great day.